so now we'll work on y axis motor and belt so uh, this is the y axis motor so this will be placed here like this okay so inside that motor will go so with the help of these screws we can uh, attach the motor with the mount so the mount will be placed like this so on this motor shaft you can see this 16 teeth uh, uh, pulley so this will be installed so that it will drive the belt okay so we can place it like this so and <coughs> this is the other side part so it will be placed like this means other side center it will be placed so and you can see this is another uh, pulley just placed with a simple screw and nut so this portion will go inside this so this using this screw we can create the tension in belt so like this yeah so and this is the belt so this will go like this then other side other two sides will go below the bed you can see here yeah here uh, let me show yeah so both ends of the belt will go like this both side <coughs> so it will be placed like this it will be placed so both ends of the belts will be placed here so so i will attach the motor with motor mount then i will place the motor mount on so i place the motor mount chassis and also place the tensioner side also and I also install the belt means both side uh, I attach the belt with the help of jib ties so, so one side of the belt will go to motor another side will go to tensioner like this so other side will go to motor can see here I'll show you a little better like so, yeah so one side of the belt will go to motor so where we install the pulley on motor shop another end will go to this tensioner so like this you can see one side motor another side is tensioner so like this so make sure it is properly centered based on that we can adjust the motor so make sure this belt is kind of like a straight so now i install the motor and belt so it will be like this so you can see there so belt is installed and if you want you can check the tension of the belt so it's not enough uh, it's not have enough tension so we have to create uh, the tension in belt uh, for that we have to go the tensioner so we need to adjust the screw with allen key so it will create enough tension in belt so this is where you need to adjust so let me zoom in yeah you can see here so let me adjust the angle where you can see belt yeah. so using this allen key you can adjust the screw so it will tighten the belt so just try to adjust enough tension so maybe yeah let me show you from this angle yeah 
the tension is enough if it is not you can adjust with the allen key but don't make it too tight again that will give another kind of a problem so now our y axis is ready <laughs> 